Welcome back. This is it. This is our last week. I hope you've been enjoying the course. I know I have. Last week, we discussed competitive positioning within your industry. We discussed the Piaggio case and how can they best position themselves within the motorbike industry. This week, we expand our purview. We talk about this issue of firm scope. And in particular, we talk about this notion of corporate strategy. Everything to date is sometimes that we've discussed can sometimes be characterized as business strategy. How does a firm compete in an individual business? Corporate strategy refers to competing across multiple businesses. So we're going to take a deep dive and look at the case of Disney. Disney is a company that has many different uh, properties, many different businesses that they operate as one coherent whole. We'll introduce a tool called diversification matrices as a way to get our hands around that portfolio of businesses Disney holds. But at the end of the day, we're going to ask similar questions that we've asked in the past. What's the industry structure? Is this an attractive industry? What's the competitive advantage that maybe Disney has in that market? And then we're going to add an additional question is, how do these businesses add value to one another? Is the whole greater than the sum of its parts? Now, this is our last week. Your final uh, reports, your strategic analyses are due at the end of this week. So clearly, you've, hopefully you've been working on them to date, but now it's time to get those completed here. I will once again be participating in forums. I'll be available to answer questions. And I encourage you again, get working on those. We're almost done here. And I think it's going to end up being something very exciting and hopefully uh, worthwhile for you. Thank you and have a good week.